Today, we're going to try out a touch-up paint kit from Touch-Up Direct. The kit comes with everything you need to touch up a scratch or a chip. Primer, paint, clear, putty, sandpaper, polishing compound, wax and grease remover, and gloves. To get started, first wipe the panel down with the wax and grease remover. Next, we'll just lightly sand the inside of those chips to make sure our putty's gonna stick. Not too far out. Again, we'll hit it with the wax and grease remover. Then we'll fill these in a little bit with some putty. They did provide some sandpaper in the putty kit, so we'll use that. I think it's around maybe 400 grit, something like that. And I just have it folded in half. And we're gonna stay real small. After we touch it up, we'll lightly sand and buff it out. And I'm going to use everything they sent in the kit. We wiped it clean again with the wax and grease remover they sent. And now we'll shake up this primer. Give it a little shot of primer. And now for some color, and I'll be wearing some jeweler's glasses. Sometimes you can brush and sometimes you can dab. If you're brushing and it's wiping the paint away, then you can dab. Yeah. 
we'll let that dry then give it a light coat of clear and I imagine you can just use the paint by itself here we'll just try it on this little spot you can also purchase little touch-up swabs and it's like a brush only a very fine little tip so we're going to use one of those for up here you just get a little bit on the end and then dab and you can be real accurate with one of these brushes. I'll get out of the way so you can see. They're real good. They soak up some paint and hold paint. You can just go and dab right down the scratch. Here's a shot of that touch-up swab up close. And now for some clear. And I'm just going to go right over the sanding. That'll be the first coat. A little couple coats. We'll let that dry and give it one more coat. The touch-up pens have a brush on one end and a marker tip on the other. So if you wanted to use that marker tip, you just the paint flows out of it. It's like a marker. So that and I'll try to get out of the way just sort of color it in there and we don't need a lot of clear on these outer parts just something to be able to fill in those little sand scratches finally We'll use some touch-up direct buffing compound as to smooth everything out and even everything out. And we're just using a paper towel. And just buffing by hand. After a couple of coats of clear, this is the finished panel. It's not perfect, but very unnoticeable. I hope you enjoyed this video on using Touch Up Direct's Touch Up Paint and Kit. 
If you did and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.